Hello everyone and welcome to Billy's Home Life. I have another rather small grocery haul to share with you today. I went to Tops and my total came to $45.09. Um, once again, I really didn't need anything to carry out my meal plan for the week. So this is a lot of produce and just a couple of other little odds and ends. Let's jump in and see what I bought this week. For starters, I have a pack of bottled water. This was on sale for $2.99 this week. And again, it's the big 32 pack, not the 24 pack. So that's actually a really good price. There was a coupon in the ad to get one half a gallon of milk for only $1.89. And um, I have a whole milk here. And I also wanted to explain something. Um, I've told you before that Nathan drinks a ton of milk. And last week I only purchased a half a gallon of milk as well. And I told you that he was going to drink it. Uh, within a day. He did. It was gone in less than 24 hours. The reason why I haven't been purchasing more milk lately is because I have some shelf stable milk that is coming up uh, to its uh, expiration date. So I want to make a point of using that up and purchasing some more when I get rid of um, the older stuff. And in case anyone doesn't know what I'm talking about, I pulled one out of my pantry so this is what I mean. I'm talking about the Gosner milk that you can purchase from the Dollar Tree. I have a bunch of these in my pantry and this one expires on May 1st of this year. So I have less than a month to get rid of this one. And then the rest of them that are in my pantry actually expire in the summer. Um, so I want to make a point of getting rid of those and purchasing new ones. Um, I don't always worry about expiration dates, but being this is milk, I do want to make a point of uh, getting rid of this. I love keeping this in my pantry. Um, I'm a firm believer in not running back to the store. If we run out of something or I forget something, um, I make do with what I have. And being I do have children, I just, um, I like having these. I like knowing that there's milk uh, in the pantry. Um, and I do live where there's snowstorms, so if I ever get snowed in, um, I like knowing that these are in my pantry. But anyways, I wanted to uh, get through these ones that are in my pantry and purchase new ones. I also have powdered milk, so that's why I haven't been purchasing Nathan uh, his typical <laughs> two gallons of milk that he goes through in a week. Anyways, uh, let's move on. The bagels were buy one, get one free. Um, and I'm not really sure. I can't remember what I paid for these. It was something like $3.79 or $3.99. I'll have to leave it down in the description box below. Uh, so anyways, I have a plain and I have an everything bagel. Uh, Noah and my husband enjoy eating bagels. The Snapple six packs were on sale this week for $4.99. I've told you this before. I get these for my hubby for his lunch box for work. I just have a bunch of bananas and they are rather green. Um, so we're going to eat these strawberries here first and then um, hopefully these bananas will ripen for us. Okay, so two packs of strawberries. These were on sale for $5.99. And that is an amazing price because these are the really big ones. These are the two pounders and I am paying $5.99 for the one pound packages in my town right now. So that was an amazing deal. I got two of them. Uh, Nathan loves eating berries. So we should be able to get through all of those. The sweet potatoes were on sale this week for 99 cents a pound. So that is what I have in this bag here. I know you can't probably see them very well. Um, the tomatoes on the vine were on sale for $1.99 a pound this week as well. Um, I just have romaine uh, lettuce in my refrigerator. So I was thinking if I made a salad, I could chop up tomatoes to go in it. There was a coupon in the ad to get a generic uh, Cool Whip for only 99 cents. It's just the Topps brand and I chose to get the light was getting a little low on vanilla so i just have some cheapy imitation vanilla here i paid a dollar 19 for that i have two 
uh, two liters of some generic uh, Topps brand pop here. I have an orange for my hubby and Noah, and I have a diet root beer for me. And Nathan really doesn't drink pop because he's my milk drinker. <laughs> The broccoli was on sale for $1.28 a pound. We absolutely love broccoli. It's our favorite. And I was going to make like some sort of a stir fry for dinner this week. Um, so that would be great in that. The cabbages were on sale for $0.79 cents a pound. Uh, so that's what's in that bag there. It's a head of cabbage. Let's see here. There was a coupon in the ad to get one three pound bag of apples for only $2.48. I have the Cortlands because those are Noah's favorite. He's my apple eater. My dad knew that I was running to the store and he asked me to pick up toothpicks for him. So this is actually for my dad. Um, these were only 79 cents. And last but not least, this is what I found on clearance in the meat section. Um, this was only $2.81 and it's a pound, so I thought that was a good deal. Um, I know you can get meat cheaper per pound than this, but I was thinking because it was ground chicken, uh, that's what's in here. I didn't mention that. Um, because the cheapest I can find ground beef is $2.99 a pound. So I was thinking $2.81 a pound, I could use this in place of a recipe in a recipe that uh, calls for ground beef that's how, how I was thinking when I grabbed this so that is everything that I got this week thanks so much for watching everyone take care